All right, time for some mail. Hey! 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 And today, got some mail, got some packages, bought some things, a couple things from the P.O. box. Also got a card I purchased. Not sure why, to be honest. It's the wrong one. It's not the right card I'm looking for, but it's a player I'm looking for. So I might as well show that now. You see it in the thumbnail? It's the Elias Rookie Signature Shots. Number 92 of 149. So I got an Elias Auto. The only thing is, I literally just sold it. So I don't have an Elias Auto anymore. Bought it and decided to sell it. I still want his future watch. Really, I've bought literally nothing towards the set since the card show video. So... I don't know right now. I'm not really collecting anything right now, but there you go. Bought this Elias. I sold it. Thought about keeping it, but yeah, there you go. This is on a piece of uh, carbon fiber. Uh, manufactured carbon fiber hockey stick. Probably never was a hockey stick, but yeah, this is a piece of carbon fiber. There you go, Elias on carbon fiber auto. All right, let's get to the packages. Let's do the purchases first. All of this I bought in September. I have not bought any cards. I've just been saving. Fall Expo is in mid-November. The Cup's coming out next week. So I kind of got to be cheap. Is that even a fly? What, what the? All right, on to some purchases. I really haven't purchased anything at all. All right, let's see what it is. All right, this thing. I actually didn't really intend to get this, but I kind of made sure it wouldn't sell under a certain price. You got it. Obsidian Scripts. UD Black. It was inserted in SBX. Numbered 30 of 30... Five, Josh Hosang. Hold on, let me get this thing out. See it better. There we go. Obsidian Scripts. UD Black. Josh Hosang. Yep, Hosang's kind of holding out right now. He's not playing anywhere. He just needs a trade. Needs to find a team that wants him. Give him a chance. Uh, hopefully he gets his career back on track. But there we go. Obsidian Scripts. Patch Auto. Josh Hosang. That's cool. Next package up. All right, which one is this? Uh, oh, okay. Got a Carter Hart, Canvas Young Guns. Still collecting them, waiting for the cup to collect him. His RPA is a 249, so it's not gonna be ridiculously expensive. For whatever reason, they got like Ely Tolvin in number to 99, and Haskinen's not 99, Hart's not 99, like what the heck. But yeah, there's a Carter Hart Canvas. Uh, got it for like 50 bucks, so. Looks pretty good, it's going to my collection. Yeah, glad to get this. Um, this was going for like like 120 bucks when Series 2 came out, or even more than that. But yeah, there you go, Carhartt Canvas Young Guns. Happy to have that one in the collection. Finally opened it, because it's been sitting around waiting to be open for like a month now. But yeah, there we go, Carhartt Canvas Young Guns. Okay, the final purchase. Let's uh, find out what it is. I think I know what it is. What the heck is that? Got some, one of those Fruit Loops? Ooh, Fruit Loops. All right, hold on, let me open this. All right, I got the top part off. Hopefully I can get the card out now. All right, there it is. Uh, it's just a Josh Hosang, regular future watch. What the heck is that? Comes with somebody's freaking hair, okay? Okay, I got somebody's DNA. Thanks, uh, seller. Cool. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Josh Hosang, future watch, auto, 204-999. Josh Hosang. Well, there's some purchases. I really haven't done much. I, I'm saving. But there we go. There's another one of these. Card I've wanted. And just a cool card for the collection. So yeah, now on to P.O. Box stuff. Only a couple things here. First one is from Noah. It says on the thing here. Open it very aggressively. Alright. Also on the address here, it says Noah's, Noah is 10. So, see what we got here. We got a note here. Let's read the note. Alright. Hey Ziri, I was looking through some of my old cards and thought you might want some. Hope you like them. I hope you like Patrick Kane. Thanks for making videos. Noah. Alright Noah, let's see what we got here. Alright, so check out these cards. Alright, looks like we got some old upper deck here. Just a few cards here. We got Pierre Turgeon from 9192. Looks like these are all from like 9192. Yari Curry. Matt Sundin. That's cool. Rod Brindamore. Mark Messier. Al McKinnis. There's Guy Lafleur. I actually did sell that Artifacts Auto of Lafleur. I did sell it. Gary Roberts. Brett Hull. A lot of really good players there. And uh, Noah sent this, uh, look at that. We got a mini Patrick Kane figure thingy. I've actually never seen one of these before. What the heck is this from? Can I mess with them? I don't know. I can't really mess with them. I think he's supposed to have a stick. I wonder where that went. Is this like a knockoff Legos because he has like the piece on there? Oh, geez. I just took his helmet off. Okay. <laughs> All right then. All right, thanks, Noah. Put him back there with Todd for now. Next one up, quite intrigued. It's a big freaking box, but then again, 
It says Walmart. I know it's not Walmart, but uh, looks like it's from Molot Hobbies. He told me to check out his channel. He's a Blues fan. So I got Petrangelo in the back there, but happy to finally open this. Been sitting on this for way too long. Get this open. <clears throat> what the heck is this? What am I looking at? The uh, okay. What the heck is that? Uh, letter enclosed. Sorry, it's a bit long. Okay, and we got some. Not sure what the heck this thing is. Not an outlet. Okay, good. Let's check out the letter. All right. Oh, we got a card in here. Oh, cool. Carrie Price, um, rookie class, jumbo. These are from like the uh, tins, or is it blasters? I had a Patrick Kane of these. I remember opening these way back when. That's cool. Carrie Price, nice big card there. I like those. I remember these. These were very cool. So that's cool. All right, here's the letter. All right, got the letter here. I already glossed over it, but here we go. Hey, Ziri, sorry for the long letter, and I'll let you decide if you like to discuss this on a mail day opening or not. Just want to let you know I've been enjoying your break videos for some time and wanted to share a few cards from my collection with you as a fellow collector. I've been collecting for roughly 30 years. I'm facing a very difficult crossroad in my life right now. I decided I want my collection to go out to people that love the hobby and sport as much as I do. You're one of the people, outside of my family, of course, that I thought of first. I was recently diagnosed with multiple sclerosis Sclerosis, MS, in May, which is a disease where my own body's immune system randomly attacks the protective nerve coverings in my brain and spine. As a result, the nerve damage disrupts the communication between my brain and the rest of my body, making it difficult at times for me to walk, talk, see, or hear. Each day I wake up just hoping that nothing new has been disconnected or something that isn't working just right gets a little better. Although there is no cure... <laughs> There are treatment options available. Many people suffer with MS on a daily basis, but with the form I have, primary progressive, there doesn't seem to be any relapse or recovery as the symptoms continue to get worse. Even with the aggressive treatment I'm on, it doesn't appear to be slowing, of course, disease. Only time will tell. The point of this letter isn't to depress you or is me looking for any type of sympathy. Just want to let you know that I and many others appreciate the hard work you put into your channel to stay Keep up the great work. I know how much time, effort, and money goes into making a video and getting content uploaded to YouTube. And even on the days when you don't feel like going through the motions, it helps people like me take their minds off the everyday problems we all face. So thank you. I hope you enjoy the cards I've sent, and please feel free to do with them as you wish. Except burn them like all artifacts products should be. All the best. Michael Scott. Yes, like the guy from The Office. There you go. Damn. <clears throat> All right, thanks so much, Michael. I really appreciate the, the kind words. Hopefully I can send some positive vibes your way. Really do appreciate it. Thank you for sending me this. All right, let's see what he sent. All right, so what do we got here? Well, it's not an outlet. Let's see what we got here. Oh, we got a bunch of cards in here. All right, let's check it out. Okay, so Michael's been collecting for roughly 30 years, so it looks like we got a wide variety of years in here. Starting off with 8889 tops. Pierre Turgeon, definitely a really cool look. I actually have a few of these thanks to uh, James. But yeah, there you go, Pierre Turgeon. Oh, is that a rookie? Not sure if that's a rookie or not. There you go, Pierre Turgeon. You got a Brett Hull. Don't think that's a rookie. I mean, he broke in in 86, 87. It might be then, might be, but that might be the rookie. I'm not sure. Yeah, there you go, Brett Hull. These must be rookies. Um, got Brandon Shanahan. That might be a rookie. There you go, Brendan Shanahan. That's Opeachy. The other two were tops. We got a score card. We got a Yarmer Yager. Fifth overall in 1990. There's a rookie card of him. There we go. Yarmer Yager. Okay. Uh, nice. We got a Jonathan Taze. Victory rookie, Jonathan Taze. This was inserted in 0708 Series 2, which I opened a lot. So that's very cool. Jonathan Taze. Do not have it anymore, so that's cool to get another one back there. Nice. Jonathan Taze. And the victory there. It's like the MVP now. Jonathan Taze. All right. Well, this is cool. Is this Beehive? Beehive. We got a Marc Andre Fleury. Beehive rookie card. That's cool. Marc Andre Fleury. Future Hall of Famer. That's cool. Same with Taze. Oh, cool, more 708. We got Milan Lucic. Got a Lucic Young Guns. That's really cool. I actually pulled one of these way back when. Series 1, right? 708 Series 1. So yeah, he's on the Flames now. I mean, James Neal is kind of doing really well for the Oilers, but Lucic finally got a point. So there's that. But yeah, there we go. Milan Lucic Young Guns. That's really cool. Ah, uh, we got this. Ah, uh, 
the Osefano Eight Series Two checklist got Devin Setaguchi, Jonathan Tays, and Yuri Talusti. Not so PG actions. But yeah, did not get the set. Jeez, Kent Huskins, Andre Pavlet, Brett Sterling. There's Tuka Rask right there. 456. Matt Hunwick, Vladimir Saboka, Mark Mancari, Mike Weber, Matt Keeley, Jonathan Tays, Mark Mathot. There's some decent names in here. Andrew Cogliano, Zach Startini, the fan mayor. Tanner Glass, yeah, that's Tanner Glass, Matt Molson, Cal Clutterbuck, James Shepard, Cal Chipchura, Rich Peverly, David Clarkson, Rod Pelly, or Martin Hansel, another noteworthy name there. You got Steve Downey and Dan Carcillo, Riley Cote. Some uh, grinder goons there. Devin Setaguchi, Lucas Kaspar, Thomas Grice, David Perron, Eric Talusti, Anton Strollman, and Chris Bork. Yeah, that's cool. I remember having this, so that's really cool. Jonathan Tays on the front there. 708 Series 2 checklist. Uh, next up is uh, a set I cannot find for the life of me, and I had the chance to buy it. I had the chance to buy a box this for 200 bucks Canadian, and I passed it up. Or like almost 200 bucks, like 189 or something. But yeah, I got a murky rookie of Jonathan Druin inserted in 1415 Upper Deck Series 2. Jeez, I cannot find any of that stuff. That's home to the David Pasternak Young Guns. It's home to Andre Vasilevsky, Bo Horvat. A lot of great players. And Jonathan Druin in 1415 Series 2. That stuff's a fortune. Can't find it anywhere. I regret not getting the box of that because Pasternak, his stuff is on fire. So yeah, there's a Druin, murky rookie retro. That's cool. Another set. This is the stuff that uh, I got back into collecting with was 1415 Series 2. So that's cool. Oh, we got an Artemi Panarin, OPC Platinum, Marquee Rookie. That's cool. Artemi Panarin, Marquee Rookie. Got some Fleer Showcase. Nice. Open a case of this stuff. Got Sebastian Ajo. Kind of had a slow start the year, but Skybox Premium Prospects, number 2499. So that's cool. Didn't get too many of those Skybox Premium Prospects, but there you go. There's Ajo. Got a Jack Eichel, OPG, Marquee Rookie. It's an update, Jack Eichel. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Got a Crown Royal, 0102, I think. Thinking about opening that. Danny Heatley Rookie, nice, very cool. Danny Heatley, yeah, that's really cool. Danny Heatley Rookie, another one for the collection, very cool. Crown Royal, interesting design there. Got the little crown on the top there. It's like a flagpole kind of thingy, maybe, right there, and the crown's on the top. Yeah, that Danny Heatley, really cool. <laughs> oh, we got a John Scott Artifacts Rookie. Nice. John Scott, number to 999, 177. John Scott, so that's cool. John Scott, nice. All right, next up, looks like we got a Future Watch, 1314. I have the set of this stuff. We got Matt Irwin, number to 1299. Matt Irwin. And we got a couple more here. We got Nathan Beaulieu, Nathan Beaulieu, Future Watch, also the 1299. And another one. Solid one. Ricard Raquel. 981 of 1299. Ricard Raquel. Uh, we got a couple more cards here. We got a marquee rookie from Platinum. Nico Heischer. Marquee rookie. There we go. We got a UD Portraits rookies of Evgeny Svechnikov. Evgeny. There we go. I actually like these portraits more than 1819, but there you go. Evgeny Svechnikov rookie portraits. And the final card. Oh, I remember these. We got a J.S. Jaguar, um, Upper Deck Classic Portraits, Pillars of Strength. Really cool looking card. Yeah, I think it's from 0304, judging by the back here. It's talking about the 03 Western Conference quarterfinals. But yeah, there we go, J.S. Jaguar. So yeah, thank you Noah for sending me this little thing, and, and thanks so much, Michael. Hoping all the best. So yeah, guys, Sunday. Giveaway, 100 packs, finally giving these out. So stay tuned for that. There will be another contest. I don't know if that video or I'll make another video, but there's another major contest. I just took a couple hours putting together. So stay tuned for that. So yeah, guys, and uh, stay tuned for a certain product coming out next week. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.